All right, friends and lovers, let's get back to it, shall we? You know, I'll be honest, um, since last time I played, uh, last night sometime, I got uh, I got a, a, a hankering for a bit more of this game. So rather than continue this file which I'm let's playing, I thought I'd uh, I start a new one, try out the daggers, and they're pretty fun. I, I, was, I was giving the daggers a hard time, but they're pretty great, been absolutely shredding my way through the game so far. And I've also found a few things that I missed on this playthrough, so uh, there'll be things we can go back and have a little look-see at later on, alright? But first, we're going to continue here. Can I just point out how fucking cool this screen looks? It's the sort of endless caverns with the technology town in the background. Technology town, that is its official name. That's, that definitely displays the sort of sinister air that we've come to expect from this area. Right. This time, this time I have utmost faith in my abilities. Why would I have utmost faith in my abilities, you ask? I honestly don't know. I don't know why I would. But, uh, you know, you have faith in you. This is new. Let's uh, deal with these fuckers before they kill me. Now, it's a lot of explosives, but there's got to be something at the end, right? Immortal Light Stone. I don't know what that is, but it seems like it's going to be important. I think that's the second one I found, and they've both been in kind of awkward places, so... Interestingly, I noticed that the Crystal Gecko things respawned as well, which I didn't realise they did. That, uh, that means there's some good farming potential there. I do need uh, 32 of them to upgrade my halberd again, so... Uh, I don't have a notice that there's a laser bridge here. Only anywhere the control panel for it was. Oh, it just it just disappears when you come in. Okay, fair enough. Boop, boop, boop. Oh shit, yeah. <laughs> I keep forgetting you can do that. It catches me off guard every fucking time. Backswing now, right? Yeah. Ooh, nice little charge attack. Very fancy. Fuck your backswing. How many times do we have to go over this? The backswing is not okay. A little bit of slow down there to really help the situation. Please just die. Thank you. Thank you so much. <sighs> I do not like fighting that fella. He doesn't make life easy for me. Please don't tell me I'm straight into a boss now. We need to. In some. There was a, a, a thing that popped up then. I didn't see that. Oh, the ladders! Shit! Okay, we have some exploring to do. Excuse me a moment. Thank god he didn't respawn. Oh, we can... We can abuse these. That'll make that fight a lot easier, actually. Good to know, good to know. But... I'm more interested in the one that was back here because there was loot above it. Pick me up, friend. Energy shield. Ooh. It's not a toughness, so it's not as good as mine. Ooh. But blocking attack enjoys you're increasing your stats for seconds. That's pretty cool. I'd I'd be using that if I hadn't just invested all the strength in the world in order to use my current shield. <laughs> just be a waste if I don't continue using that one now. But uh, it's good to know that I have. Uh, some pretty fucking cool shields in this game. 
Between that and the one that emits light, that was also pretty pretty funky. Oh, well, you're not an item. They're very well disguised, those mines. I know that they're obviously not items, because items have, like, glowing powder coming off them, like that one up there. Um, also, some of them are blue. But, uh, can we go like this? Two birds, one stone. That, get the item, and explode all the mines, making the future a much nicer place to live in. That mine can get fucked. I have no reason to go near that. No re- hmm, maybe there is a reason. Nope. Worth testing. There's been a lot of secret passages in this area so far, so... You know, helps to- This is back at the start. This is back at the start. No, it's not back at the start. My bad. Although... That is where I got the gun last time. Maybe yet. I think maybe this game didn't auto-save quite as uh, regularly as I thought it did, and uh, it hadn't saved some of the attempts I'd had previously, which is fine, because I didn't really get much out of it. Question becomes, what now? We've gone in a circle. There's uh, some sort of crystal up there. Yeah, I've not got this either. That's probably why we don't have the gecko. I kind of want to go get the gecko now. Let's, uh... I know the bad thing should be dead at this point. Okay. Maybe not. Let's head back this way. Was this glowing before? Probably. Probably overanalyzing again. I want to, uh... Just skip through the big uh, vat of blood again. I want to have a look at this map. There's a down. There's a right. There's a right. Ah, okay, I see. Bottom of the old shaft. There's there is a right. I never properly explored. That might be worth my time. We'll head back over there then. Not the engine cloak either. I hit a button. Don't know what the button did, but I hit it. I mean, technically, we could just grab onto that and be carried across that, but why waste our time, eh? So, thanks to the power of the map, we know that there is something here. Got a lift. And we have a lift shaft. That's a nice combination of items. I guess we'll go down. Oh, good. That makes me feel a bit less tense. Give me... All the endurance in the world. <laughs> I think it's only one level up at this point. I didn't even confirm that. I didn't even confirm it. Confirm it, I did not. There we go. All the endurance in the world. Hello. Look, dude, if you want to go, we can go. I ain't afraid of no space ghost. See? And nor should I be. Can't go through here yet. So I guess that means... Up. Carefully up. Right, you little dicks. You can stop whenever you want to. Oh, didn't see that. Hit all these switches. Oh god, there's a load over here as well. We probably want to, gonna want to start with these ones, aren't we? We'll wait for more to reset. 
then we can just go bloop, bloop, bloop. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, there we go. Still worked. Still counted. Alright. So if I'm there, that means... That guy's having trouble. Oh, a droid cranium. My favorite. It's a helm, and a hella good helm as well. Or a helm a good helm. <laughs> Shame it doesn't actually affect my character model. That would be nice, by the way. That's one thing I would love to see in this game. Actual equipment changing how you look. It's only the cape and the weapon that seem to change in any way, so... I'd quite like to see how I look wearing a, a droid's face. That's a shortcut, very nice. Alright, what does this mean? Negatively charged, and presumably positively charged. Right, we want to see if we... Well, I was the opposite to what that guy was, and it, I don't know if that meant... Yeah, okay, I seem to do less damage to things. I get you. I get you. You always want to be the opposite to what the enemies are, if at all possible. And that's generally the goal. Well, that's convenient then. Don't like those. Oh. Shit, um, yeah, I'm not going to fight one of these with the wrong charge. Excuse me while I go back and reset. Actually kind of a pain in the ass mechanic, if I'm honest, unless they're going to dot a lot more of these charging stations around, because I don't much fancy running all the way back to just achieve this. Oh, well, I can two-shot these now. Good job, positive charge. Or neg negative charge, that's what you are. Although I could also say good job to the positive charge as well, because... Uh, let's face it. The, the, the enemies have the positive charge. So they're also helping with this situation. There's a lot of, of dudes in this corridor. And while I'm gl still happy I took the... The one that made the harder enemies easier it means I'm having to really, really fight my way through here. I don't feel like I'm making a great deal of progress. I don't know if these are infinitely spawning at me or if uh, there's just a fucking lot of them. It certainly feels like they're infinitely spawning, but really wish I'd stop getting hit by that lightning. Literally all that's fucking damaging me so far. Not to make myself sound like an elite gamer or anything, but uh... what the fuck? Just the lightning just took off half my fucking health there. That's not okay. Feathers, I suppose. <laughs> Can't remember what, what I was fighting first there. Oh, the droid cranium. Never have enough of those. 
Yeah, now we want to switch back. We can start slowly making our way up this fucking corridor again. Really didn't get far, did we? That's a bomb. Oh, what? Well, fuck all this. Really wish I'd gone blue. The swarm. Jesus, that was a lot of lasers. Kind of want to kill uh, that thing up there if I can. Can I? I can. It is capable of death. I don't know why I care particularly, but just the fact that, hang on, hang on, switch to a, let's switch to a gun, I'm going to use the swarm, I can, seems very similar to the other gun, honestly, but We'll give it a go. Nice. These guns are pretty sweet for people who don't have high finesse. I imagine arrows and archering is better for for your your dex build, but as a big strong man, I need uh, something a bit more uh, appropriate for my stature. Anti-gravity field? Is that going to improve my jumping capabilities? Because that'll be pretty sweet. Let's have a look at it, shall we, instead of just having a guess at what it might do. Reduces the stamina cost of attacks. Activating this mechanism grants a sense of weightlessness that people have... Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Okay, just reduces the stamina cost of attacks. But that sounds really good. So we're going to go ahead with it. Oh, I'm all... Oh, I, I'm not nice to look at now, though. That's something worth noting. <laughs> it might look a bit better when I'm not negatively charged, potentially. But, uh. Hey, Death's over there. What's he doing chilling in this area? Nice. Wait, 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 can I go again? I can go again. Uh, where do I want to put my next point? Do I want to get a bit more haste, a bit more vit, maybe? Could keep uh, keep going with the strength. That's still giving me a nice damage return. Um, I think I will get a bit more of it. Try and get a bit up to 15, maybe 20. Alright, Death, what say you? Death? Yes. Be quick about it, I'm playing a game. A game? Yes, it is actually quite fantastic. It touches on themes of life and death. I keep trying to get a high score, but my character seems to die before I can achieve anything. That does not sound very fun. Uh, why must they all be fun? You lack vision. Okay, well, I guess that's just going to loop now. Is this where we... Yeah, that feels like where we want to go. Let's see what's in the other direction. More of this positive-negative bullshit. Take me up, then. Oh! 
Well, I guess this is where we wanted to go. Bye, Surge the Lightning Lurker. Okay. Okay. What? Well, I got fucking nothing out of that. That was... And it's not like he was particularly aggressive, but he has, from what I could tell, one attack that just drains your health, just channels it at you and your health just goes down and there doesn't seem to be much you can do about it. And another attack that hits the entire arena. So, uh, neither of them seemed exactly fun. Let's see what's up here then. A really fucking dark place, cool. Oh, hello. Let's just actually get up there. Is this going to be where I think it is? Dot, dot, dot. Yeah, this is some part or other of the uh, the old underground. Jim, that's where we're going to come up after we beat by Surge. Um, interesting. Okay. Was there anything? Let me go back up, you horrible, horrible game. Is there anything off to the right? No? Okay. So basically our options right now were... I mean we can just flee the whole area admittedly. But uh, seems more sensible to go for the old buy surge I suppose. I think I picked the right polarity at least. I think I got lucky on that one. It, it did. There was like a countdown though for something called polari polarity surge. Or something along those lines. Which I'm assuming is going to mean he's going to switch polarity at some point. Which means we're going to have to try and finish him while the initial polarity is up. Which... Oh no, he is actually red. So we, we did actually pick the wrong one. Okay, we can get out of that, but not easily. See, but this... What is this? I don't know if he's also doing less damage to me, though, is the only thing. I don't know what he's doing. Oh, he's changing. Oh shit, there's... <laughs> I, just... I straight up didn't notice that he was uh, lightninging everywhere while he was doing that. But it is possible to get out of the big, uh, the big dome at least. I don't know about the, the channeled lightning business, that just seems to be, I guess you're gonna lose health. Um, I don't know. We'll have a play, see if we can work something out, and you'll get to see the final result, hopefully. Assuming there is a final result. Fingers crossed. Fuck. Well, this attempt's over. Are you keeping score? It's rather entertaining, actually. What? Are you resigning yourself to defeat already? You'll never accomplish anything with that attitude. 
Go reclaim your phoenix plumes at my idol if you've lost them. And do dodge at the right time. It's just embarrassing to watch, really. Thanks, Death. That's awfully nice of you. That can't be the first time I've died six times to a, a boss in this, can it? Maybe it is. I died more to a, a Riga, but uh, those apparently didn't count. <laughs> I, was, I was on two deaths permanently for that one. I hate this attack so much. It doesn't do a lot of damage if you're the right colour, which is why I think coming in red is a really good idea, but that and the big opening you get when you blue. Does mean you have to make sure you're good during the blue phase though, because it, everything does so much damage. Really need to take more advantage of that opening. I need more you shutting the fuck up and stopping doing that attack because it's really mean. get the last one because he starts moving so I think he's, he's done but he's still got one more to come every time oh fuck that was that was bad as was that fuck 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 give me an opening give me an opening let me heal thank you no no oh. Please don't wake all those up. What? Did you just... Ugh. I ran a pretty serious gamut of emotions there. <laughs> saw all the dudes at the back was like, shit, are they all coming to life now? Then saw that his health bar fully regenerated. <laughs> and that really shot me up. Oh, my heart is going. That Another cool fight. Another very cool fight. I've got to say, um, as much as I love Salt and Sanctuary, this game fucking nails 2D Souls Light bosses. Absolutely fucking nails them. Whew. What's this? No. No. <laughs> no, we're not doing that. I might go try the, uh, the Owl King at some point. The Heroic Owl King rematch. This would just be the lift. Yeah, okay, cool. But, uh... Not ready for this guy yet. What lies beyond them? Oh. 
Oh, this place looks nice. We've gone from System Shock 2 to Resident Evil. Okay, so we're gonna want to keep pumping a bit more of it for now. Level 60, good. I feel like I've been playing that long. I'll just climb this pile of corpse. Mm. Let's spend those talent points, shall we? While we wonder what that is. Uh, blocking at the perfect moment reduces stamina loss by 50%. I'm not that hot shit when it comes to blocking, but fuck it, we'll get it. Uh, what else? Do not lose soul energy while standing still. It does sound good, but I don't know how good. I'm going to finish the weapon... One, increase the damage of your weapon by 2%. That's nice. Killing enemies lowers the time of any abilities. Yeah, so sounds pretty good. What's this? I didn't even notice. It's get double experience from killing enemies if you are mortal. When am I mortal? Is that a thing? <laughs> Ability equipped in slot 3 has cooldown reduction. Actually, that's really good, because especially considering what I've got in slot 3 right now, which is my damage buff, which I can currently only use like once per fight if I'm lucky. Uh, max soul energy increased by 30. Yeah, this actually seems like a pretty good tree. We'll go down this one now. Oh, we've got 20% boost for 10 seconds after regaining a lost phoenix feather. Still don't really know how that works, but we'll take it. Oh, thanks, light. That's... I think we found the place where we could really do with that light spell. No, it's not that. It's not that... that dark, I guess pretty dark. It's pretty fucking dark. Are we assuming that thing's going to be the boss of this area? I knew this thing would fucking come at me. I was just waiting to see how long it took to break out. Die! Ah, da ah, ah. I guess it's not the boss of the area. It's right here. Just a normal, just a normal enemy. Just normal. A really, really aggressive normal enemy. Continued carving my ass up even after it even after I was dead. I said even after it died, but it clearly didn't die. It was I who died all along. Now what that gas those things let off is, but we probably don't want to find out either. Wow. Shields are just bad. <laughs> I didn't use my shield at all against Biosurge. It was all about the rolling. Nothing to block, it was just energy everywhere. And against this thing, it was just... Well, I guess your shield's broken. Are you gonna break out and come at me too? Nope, okay. I guess you're happy there. Huh. Well, that was nice at least. I don't like the look of this rickety bridge. Yep, yep, okay. I guess we just go for it. You can fuck right off with it. Oh, well that weirdly glitched back into existence. Don't trust Iron Maidens after Demon Souls. Go up here. If we can go up, maybe we'll be getting out of this horrible hellscape. Oh look! that door that I was all like, yeah, this will just be just after after buy surge, and it was. I mean, a little bit further after buy surge, to be fair. Not immediately after buy surge, but we got there in the end. Oh, we can go down more. I don't. The dark beckons. I fucking love to, mate, but I need the ivory key, unfortunately, which I assume is going to be further into the depths. Good. Need it for this as well. 
You guys appear to be crying souls at each other. That's nice. Something over there. Can we get over there? Did the bridge... Hmm. There's a hole here we could maybe do some tactical falling down. Well, I guess we're here now. That wasn't so bad. That's really mean. I don't get the item, I don't get the crystal gecko, I, I don't get anything. It just all it just all falls away from me. As as the corn song goes. How more of these? I've seen any of these in a while. They still haven't got particularly threatening. Oh no. I don't want to fight you in ankle deep water if it's all the same. What? Was the water killing me? Was the water killing me and I didn't notice? That was weird. Uh, Pretty certain this didn't happen. This seems like some sort of fever dream. What is this? What are you doing? Your mind and actions will be your own. Stop. Well, at least we get another shot at that gecko. That was close. I don't care, I got a blindfold. Death can take me all it likes. I got a blindfold. It's probably not even good, is it? Let's have a look at it. Four strength, four finesse. It's actually pretty boss, but I mean, I've got my 11 bit uh, skull of a droid, so uh, I think we're good for now. That gecko seems completely unfeasible though. Maybe a high finesse build could shoot it, but... Not even here. Speaking of which, neither is my... Oh, I didn't drop a feather, apparently. Do you not drop a feather if you die from falling? It's possible. I honestly don't know. Blades plus three, nice. Someone wants to drop me a halberd plus five, I'm not going to complain. Yeah, this blood hurts, okay. Big hurty blood. Don't really seem to have much say in uh, anything, though. I quite went all the way through there just to get fucking feather and then just used it as soon as I got back. Come on, we'll fight over here. I don't really want to fight you at all, if I'm honest, but better this than in the insta-death blood. That seems to be the best opening. With a halberd, anyway. Any slightly shorter weapon and I wouldn't have shit. I think we've got some sort of handle on those now. This is still just... Uh, uh, piss off, you cunt. No, it's, not a, it's not a Metroid 2D vignette. Do you... Souls-like 2D Metroid thing without a big wooden wheel that you have to go around. An essential part of the formula. Hello! You don't seem too bad. You seem quite nice, in fact. I don't like how there's a gold chest here, though, because that means you have to get through that blood and fight that big boy without using a healing item. Approach. What? 
What are you? Thy salvation, if thou hast the courage to imbibe my words. I'm listening. Thou art afflicted by a false hope. Beyond the darkness, thy naked mind shrivels. If thou is to wake, renounce death. Renounce death? So... What, she's gonna offer me a different kind of immortality? I feel like, as powerful as this being is, the other guy is literally death. So it's, uh... You know... Just saying. <laughs> this is... There's probably still some sort of, uh... Advantage to staying with, with my good pal death. It's nice that you can upgrade shit, though. Can you upgrade my droid cranium? You can. I, I kind of would like to save up to upgrade. I'd upgrade my H7 Lancer. Or, or make me swarm. That could be a very good idea. It doesn't cost a lot to do the early upgrades, but I need to save. I want to get a plus 5 halberd, goddammit. I want it to be as good as the hammer. Or the great sword, or any of these other weapons that are far too good. Do you hear the voices? You hear it too, don't you? The whispers. Thou hast fallen prey so soon. Wither then in thine own mind. Okay, what are you teaching me? Essence of darkness. Create a floating dark orb, attacking a tome weapon causes the floating elemental orbs to combine into a unique attack. That sounds really cool. I really wish I'd been a magician. He was extremely high damage to all enemies on screen. That requires finesse and int. I think uh, in my dagger game I've just started, I might try and stop putting points in int as well so I can, I can become a death magician. That sounds pretty fun. But, uh, all that aside... Oh, that's pretty cool. Not as good as the one I'm using, I don't think. But um, All that aside, I don't think there's much here for me, to be honest. So uh, I'm going to go back on my way. Uh, nice to meet you. You're a nice lass. There's a thing up there. I don't know how I'm meant to get that. And there's a thing up there. I don't know how I'm meant to get that. The wheel doesn't take me high enough. Oh, fuck off. I should have guessed there'd be some of them about, but... Ivory Key! Huzzah! Oh, no, 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 That was a bad combination of things that was happening there. I just, I just, I just want that. That's all I want. See you later. Well, that was incredibly rude. That was incredibly, incredibly rude. Did y'all see what happened there? Did you get, get a taste of that? Fucking lightning bolting me off a ladder. I've done to deserve all this. Hmm. I know this isn't the way, but there's a there's a shrine here. Oh, you're not a shrine. Fuck you, asshole. Are any of these going to be shrines? No, none of those are going to be shrines. However, that was pretty fucking sweet. <laughs> I enjoyed that. Oh no, fuck that. Fuck that right off. We're not going that way yet. There was another route. Just down this ladder, I believe. I will take this, the Eldritch Council. Ah, 
I would love to read about the Old Rich Council, but um, unfortunately I have place to be. I have place to be, that's what I said. Fuck you, that's good English. You're bad English. Annoyingly, I'm going to have to go back through here now. And it's not going to be fun. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Oh, I had my feathers. A feather was probably a good choice there, actually. That's cool. Oh, a loot. Sunstone. I don't know what those do, but cool. What was up here? This was just the shortcut out, wasn't it? Right, so. What did that little book about the Eldritch Councils have to say? The wind carries whispers of the Crimson Court, a secret society beneath Aldrin run by Inquisitor Holdrum. All came to eventually know the prison spire as their journey's end. Right, that's why this place is called Journey's End. I get it. No point doing anything with any of those lads. I really wish I could kill this. I really need to discover some methodology for dealing with such things. Oh no, that was mean. Huh. I don't think I've been here though. So, uh, thanks, I guess. Opening my eyes to a new locale. Fact, if we slip down this here ladder. Would you fucking die? Thank you. My, that's a lot of these fellas. My oh my. Keep making me lose loot. Are you a real shrine? No, of course you're not. Ah, fuck it. Why are those things everywhere? What have I done to deserve these things? Alright, we did have a system for these. We just got just gotta use it. I mean that wasn't the system, but if it works, it works. Mm -hmm. Whatever. I don't know where I'm going. I'm genuinely fucking lost at this I think we just found a boss fight. What the fuck is going on? This is all a bit of a bit of a clusterfuck. I mean, nothing's really, nothing really terrible has happened just yet. But uh, I feel like this is yeah. That wasn't anything to do with the boss. It didn't affect his health in any way. When do we get to hit the boss? We're just fighting weird fish demons at the moment. And I, I note that the, the blood level is rising as well. It did seem to drop after a little while, which was something I suppose, but... Uh, yeah, I guess we're fucked now. Kill it! Take the blood away! Take the blood away! Just doing it again! I don't have the damage output for this fight. 
I don't have a plus five weapon yet. I'm trying. I really am trying, but I'm out of feathers now, so I guess this is death. Loyal to a fault. Beautiful. Use it on Norifix. Hm. You could learn a thing or two from her. She sounds insane to me. Devotion not straddles the line. <laughs> I need more damage. We'll get one more point in Vit, and then we'll go back to putting points in strength, because we need more damage. Unless we can find some way of gaining immunity to that blood damage, there's, there's no chance of me doing that fight right now. Oh, bye then. Ahem. Yeah, that was absurd. Cheers, mate. Passing through. Why though? I really You're looking rather sickly. More so than usual. Thanks. Um yeah, I lost maximum health due to contagion. I guess that's what those little fuckers were doing. I got some panacea, and probably. Removes contagion, yeah. much better. But the point is, this place is horrible. For one, I need to find a way of killing those ghosts. I don't know if you are just meant to have to ignore them, but if that's the case, it's really mean. <laughs> Stop. Places to be. <gasps> it's real! I found a real one! I just need to... Fucking think. There's some more contagion for me. Lovely. But there are no enemies nearby. Okay, aside from the big scary thing above, but maybe that's going now. Please let me use the shrine. Please. Pretty please. I'll cure my contagion. Will that help? I mean, the big thing just jumped off a cliff, so, I mean, that's dealt with. If I can't rest with a ghost nearby, then what the fuck am I meant to do? Because I, I literally can't kill them. They are literally unkillable. Literally. I'm just going to keep saying the word literally until you let me rest at this shrine. Come on, game. Got me some slack. I'm a good guy. 
Oh, this is here. I was here. <laughs> We're gonna have to find a way of killing that ghost. There's gotta be some way of killing that ghost, surely. Right? I just can't think. I like normally in games it's magical damage to kill ghosts. Oh great, another one. Fucking A. Let's bring that with us so that we definitely can't rest at the shrine. Yes! Yes! <laughs> yes! Victory! I'm I'm completely cool with this. Right, we're going to wrap up here. I know I still have more of this area to explore, but I've, it's been like an hour and change. So, um, this seems like a good stopping point. I might have to Google how to kill ghosts before next time. I'm sorry, I know that goes against my whole blind playthrough thing, but uh, we're not getting anywhere with them. And there's got to be some secret to it, so we'll... We'll, uh... It's probably something really simple and I'm just an idiot, but, but I'm going to look it up. And uh, after that, we'll have a, a full exploration of what remains of this area. I don't think there's much left to see, to be fair. I think we've seen most of it, but there might be a bit more. Um, and uh, then we'll try and take on that boss, maybe, after after we've really run out of other options. Okay, so uh, until then, you guys be good. Don't masturbate too furiously, it can it can really leave your dick feeling a bit sore. Or your vagina, I don't know. Um, maybe you have both, I'm not judging. Regardless, I'll see you then. Goodbye.